Welcome back to Weeb Gamer, the podcast where we talk about everything to do with video games, anime, and anything else we want to talk about. That was very weird because I said it in the opposite. Order. Yeah, you did it backwards. Yeah, what the freak? I did. That was awesome. Nice try. Anyways, and we also talk about Weeb's Gamers and podcasts and all that Ooh, fun stuff because Sean said that one time when I wasn't here, yeah. and then we're just running it's with just it. Stuff. We're, just, we're, Anyways, just, we're just literally just running with it. Anyways, I'm joined once again by my beautiful co-host Sean and Alan. Um, we're gonna try to keep this week's conversation very apolitical and um yeah and this is also your weekly reminder that flock is a king don't you diss flock he's a great he's amazing king we flock love. we stand flock king flock okay. he was the clown guys doing he season? was the clown you motherfuckers okay oh my god sorry <laughs> uh i'm i'll start i'm doing fantastic i'm tired um today was today was good i changed my winter tires to summer by I've been wa- wow. I, just so you know, I've been literally reading no. multiple reports that there's gonna be a blizzard. Literally, bro. Okay, I was literally gonna follow up with that. <laughs> I, I, my neighbor's like, hey, uh, you know, the J- Joe Billy Bob comes out and he's just like, hey there, young sport. You know, it's gonna snow next week. And I kind of <laughs> look up and I'm just like, I don't give a fuck. And I just like went back to doing what I'm gonna do. I'm uh, just saying, hey, you better cut that f word out, bro. Uh-huh. Oh, we are minute. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always do a minute. I always, I always watch it a minute in to see if we swear. But yeah, fuck this no, fucking podcast. Minutes. All right. Five. It's five minutes, bro. Okay. Um, <laughs> continue. Sean, how you doing today? Uh, I'm doing okay. I'm exhausted and my throat hurts because I'm training someone to replace oh, you me. Training, <laughs> you training them all right. Oh, my uh, God. You don't know. Your throat hurts because you're training someone. That is great. Yeah. Sean also <laughs> has a clinic on I'm uh, talking. Young and Dundas. Um, if you guys know Toronto Young and Dundas, that's where he trains his clients um, just just all day. Young and Dundas Square? So I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know anything. Nathan anymore. Phillips Square. Nathan Phillips Square, right in the right no, in the center. No, Toronto Young and Dundas Square right. is not Nathan Phillips Square. Those are two different places. I didn't. I didn't know. Okay. <laughs> anyway, sorry, Sean. Go ahead. I'm also, the, you're not a Toronto man. I said I would say this, but the highlight of my day is that uh, my girlfriend is watching FMA, and she Ooh. referred to Colonel Mustaine as Colonel Mercedes by accident. <laughs> 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 Yo, Colonel McLaren is lit. I was like, like also, a car, car. also a car, also a car, but the wrong car. Like, <laughs> hey, you know what? Fuck it. That's that's you know at least at least she got it right. Um, uh, that's all we gotta say. Good uh, for her. Good they for killed her. me. I died. I was like, that's <laughs> what I needed. This is this is why. This that's is why it, we're man. Good, good shit. Good shit. <laughs> uh, we got we got tons of anime to talk about today. But before we yeah. get to it, Andre, how you doing today? I don't how you doing, this. Andre? What's going on, bro? Like I showed up today. <laughs> bro. I woke up in the morning. <laughs> Listen, have you ever, like, well, when you wake up in the morning, like, how do you feel? Do you be like, oh, my God, it's the day? Or no. do you no. feel like, oh, I guess I guess this thing is going to keep going. Yeah, yeah. that's how so work like, is, yeah. Yeah, so, like, when I, when I, like, when I, when I, when I wake up, I always, like, do the thing where I, I take the fork from under my pillow and I go to the outlet. I'm like, ah, oh, no, ah, no, okay, not today. And then you toss it aside. <laughs> I just really get really angry. Me, I'm just like, you know, like every week when there's a new Tokyo Revengers chapter, oh, just like, oh, oh, yeah, this yeah. is still going on, huh? <laughs> and then that's how I feel. That's what I feel like when I wake up. I'm just yeah. like, or like when last week when Attack on Titan ended and you're just like, oh, they're just going to keep going with this. That's <laughs> how I feel when I wake up in the morning. I'm just like, oh, like, it's not over yet. Like, this is just going to keep going. All right, I guess. I guess so. I guess we just got to keep reading. We got to make it to the end, right? Because yeah. I've invested this much time in oh, it. Yeah. I guess I might as well make it to the end. Oh, right? yeah. Damn. Alan with his um, freaking rental girlfriend shit. <laughs> yo, top, you, the top tier. I recommend everyone to just go ahead and re- catch up on everything. It, it's character development, so much better than than it, there's none, there's zero. But yo, just this just guy watch, can just get go. through the third episode and then proceed to read the entire mega. <laughs> you know, you know what? Something about reading and me not can't and not being able to right? just really it's, helps me. Yeah, it just really right? helps me. Yeah. Uh-huh, yeah. It does. Yeah. Right. It's like that's the thing. Like when we were reading Soul Leveling back in the day, it was literally just like it was just oh, action, man. I can <laughs> read the whole story in seven minutes. Exactly. <laughs> Speaking of solo leveling, Andre. Uh, <laughs> well, basically, I was dude. on Instagram the, earlier today, and apparently they're continuing it. They're Ooh. making special chapters about life after the whole war thing. So I guess that means solo leveling slice of life. Is so, that what's happening? Are we checking, yeah. uh, <laughs> Is that what it's going to be? I mean, a, they, they beat the bad guy. <laughs> Is this gonna be they beat the bad guy. So what else could it be? <laughs> My dress up necromancer. That's what it's going to be. <laughs> Fuck well, it. Well, Let's do it. Will this be the burrito to the Naruto series? No, no. He's not going to no, have no, a kid. No, no. He's not gonna <laughs> I, I'm hoping I'm hoping that they kind of just do like mm. uh 
after the events kind of thing where it's yeah, just like yeah, a few yeah. chapters it's like a few chapter maybe like one volume of them just kind of like living their lives oh, that'd be nice. yeah a little summary because that's what we all like aot should do that i i if they if they haven't because obviously i haven't read it but mm-hmm. they, if whatever happens they should do like a you know like you know like in, and i'm not being weird here but like every good like um, um african-american movie that has like really good storytelling at the end it's mm-hmm. like um, whatever, like Nathan is now working at a bank for 25 uh, yeah. years and like it has his face just kind of like, like turning. Yeah. You can say black. Bro. I, I can't. This is YouTube, man. You, you, can, you, you can say it. I ain't saying it. I can't. Say I'm it. saying African. Man. <laughs> There's no shot. I'm taking that risk. I ain't getting canceled on a Friday here. That's when our audio comes out. I don't want to get canceled on a Saturday when the video get canceled. Uh, can- oh, shit. <laughs> um, <laughs> what time? What <laughs> time? Fucking, fucking two at two a.m. Be sure to. Yo, we need a, we need a, we need a timestamp king, bro. We need someone who just literally listens to us talk nonsense and like he like literally is like that's not making it. That's cut. <laughs> that's, that's cut. 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 It's supposed to be Sean, but I am doing it in the background. No, you're not. No, you're not. It's fine. Are you actually? It's fine. Yeah. No, he's not. He's just trying to. <laughs> as as what I'm doing here, because like I. Actually I mean, you can it. start. You can literally start now. I mean, we're seven minutes in, but you can literally just put. No, no, no that's me. It's one me. minute to ten minutes, nonsense. Well, what are we? And then to? continue from there. What are we there. starting with? You don't know. We'll figure it out we'll when we get Figure that there, out after we. Alan it. is telling. Alan is telling us things about something. What Solo we, leveling. <laughs> we we're just oh, talking about it. Oh yeah, yeah. So. Like I can't wait for it. the I can't wait for the book to come. Uh, the you know I pre-ordered it like seven months ago, and I'm, I'm sure Andre. Yo, they too. keep pushing back they the keep, friggin' date. Uh, it was yeah. March, it, and then it was April. Now it's May. What the hell what is, is going this? on, bro? This is racism. Uh, Actually, nonsense, bro. I'm honestly videos. waiting for friggin' Volume Five to show up so I can buy it, bro. It's but volume. they're taking too long. <laughs> they're taking. Too, yeah, honestly, I buy the whole collection, but goddamn, yeah, they're taking too long, bro. Wow. But whatever, it is what it is. Soul leveling is amazing. Um, if they ever make it into an anime mm-hmm. i need them listen if the anime comes on 2025 i need them to already be working on it yeah because if i see those war scenes yeah if they're cgi uh, I'm, just, uh, I'm gonna cry I'm yeah gonna no, 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 no. Cry. the thing about soul leveling too is like i feel like it's a good um it's good for people who are like into like they're not into anime or like manga but they read like western comics because it has that western mm-hmm. comic kind of feel like absolutely like yeah. even the graphic novel kind of feel like it just feels so good yeah. um like not not like manga, but uh, closer to the Western kind of um, absolutely yeah, feel. Yeah. Yep, one hundred percent. And yo, I was on TikTok the other day. Some guy dissed. And he's like, "Oh my gosh, if you're between the ages of eighteen and twenty, f- whatever, like eighteen and like basically twenty three, twenty two, mm-hmm. you like." The overpowered character who always wins and stuff. I'm like, I literally commented. I don't comment on anything ever. Yeah. <laughs> but this time I was like, listen, I'm twenty six. And I fucks with Jin Woo. Okay, don't Jin diss Woo. the over, don't diss the overpowered character. Yeah. It is honestly a very fun time on occasion. Yes, it's great to see the story about them building and like learning and stuff. But sometimes you just want to see a dude smack down. Oh yeah, like who doesn't like Gojo? Exactly. Right. You know? Sometimes you just want to see a guy smack down some <laughs> bad guys. That's I'm it. I'm telling right? you, uh, you guys saw in the movie, man. There's no shot you don't like him. There's no shot. Yeah. You have to like him. You have yeah. to. Pretty much. Oh, man. That friggin' 10 second wombo combo. Yeah, shit. he was giving. Amazing. Yeah, he took it. He took. Ooh. He took out the the BLM tag off of his bio and oh just said, "Let's God. go." <laughs> okay. Remember that at the beginning when bad. I said this was gonna be an A political podcast, yeah. bro? Remember? I do remember that. Yeah. Yeah, but I went with the B side, so I'm I'm B political. Yeah. I'm B. Nobody political. knows. It. Not everyone knows. It's that. fine. Okay. Yo, ten minutes. Timestamp. Timestamp. <laughs> cut it out. Oh, cut it out. <laughs> All right, my bad. I'll cut it out. Um, oh my God. I was gonna say, oh, uh, gaming news before the anime, Kingdom yeah. Hearts yes. Four out of nowhere oh, was was a, a little nowhere teaser teaser trailer for us, which uh, made us made me a little. I bit, will say what question quickly. Yes, quick, it wasn't quick. out of nowhere. So earlier kind of. there was um, Nvidia. Yeah. There was basically a huge leak. They um, went into Nvidia. Um, oh. They released like a long list about games coming up, and Kingdom Hearts Four was actually on that list. Ooh. He was, keeps asking for these games still. I thought it was wrapped hey, up. Hey, hey, hey. You stop it. I, I, Yo, well, did you I see am. it? Did okay. you see it? Kingdom Hearts 4 trailer? Yeah. It just looks like Final Fantasy. That shit looked beautiful. Yeah, it it looks did look really good. It looked good. I, I don't know if it's going to be good. It uh, might be garbage, but it looked fucking good. It looked very good. Not going to lie. Could be, it looked it like I saw his shoes. Out. I'm like, I need freaking <laughs> Sora shoes, bro. Yeah, those bro. are some fire-ass yeah, shoes. He, That's he, all I need. He took off those Ronald McDonald's and put on some goddamn Nike Zooms or something because that guy was running up walls and shit. 
Oh, actually, we, we, um, we won't actually get the game till like 10 years from now. So. Oh, whatever. Hey, it's hey, fine. Hey, 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 I'll hey, make sure my kids play Unreal Engine 5, guys. Guys, you guys don't even understand. Yeah, you can what upload the potential your is. Face. Obviously, for now, we're not going to get games that look like what the potential is. Yeah. But yeah. I've literally watched like a tech demo of Unreal Engine 5. Yeah. And like it was like indistinguishable from real life. Yeah, like, yeah. Like it's ridiculous. That's scary. And with ridiculous. this whole metaverse coming in at the same time as Ooh, like Unreal Engine 5, I feel like we're going to get to a point real quick. I feel like it's not going to be. Like, if we look at how technology has advanced in the past, yep. it would it's going to take time. But I feel like technology has also been advancing exponentially. Mm -hmm. So I feel like we're going to hit a point within the next few years mm -hmm. where it's just going to be like, boom, boom accelerate. And now yeah. we're going to sort out online. It's real. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> <laughs> Catch me on there trying to kill some people. Not Nope. <laughs> not kidding. I'm going to tell you 100%. If we get trapped in there, I will... Spend all of my life in the first town. One hundred percent. Oh yeah. I, 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 I'm, not I, I'm not risking a it. Tower bro, could come that. up. A tower could come up, and I'm gonna be look, me and Andre and Sean look over at each other and be like, "We're gonna go be bakers today." Merchants. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're, merchants. We're gonna, we're gonna go sell oh, yeah. some bread. For sure. Gamer I mean, podcast in the in the fucking sort of. Give me online. all the muscle atrophy you got. Like yeah. I don't give a shit. You don't care. Yeah, we, we ain't touching <laughs> yeah. that thing. I'll get one sword, and now I'm like, I'm not gonna kill one single monster, bro. Hell Nothing. No. Hell no. I'm like, gonna kill you. Like they come out of the game, and you're just like level zero, and it's like, what the hell you been doing in there, man? Like, <laughs> like hundred, 100 years All later, stats. like, like you're supposed to be like the savior of the game, and they're just like, your fishing is at like level 100, but like everything else is at zero. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck have you been doing? <laughs> Oh my god, uh, that's how it needs to be. Bro. That, that no was me runescape. Finish. That was a uh, completely me runescape. I got my woodcutter nope. axe, cut down some trees, got that lumber right. uh, wood yep. axe cutting stat to 100. Sold yep. some logs, man, made like millions, but couldn't that's fight it. for shit. That's it. You know, you go to, you go to the black market with that wood, you just start building oh, fires yeah. to get your fire camp uh, uh -huh. thing up. It's just like, why oh, not? Yeah. Good times. And then when they put the stock exchange in, you're, oh, the, uh, the trade exchange, it's just like, oh, oh. Man. Yeah, GG. This is it. This is it. This is Yo, my, this also, is my life. speaking <laughs> of um, like other world, like video game style. Yeah. Like I've been watching Konosuba. Mm. This guy's death count is approaching real close to friggin' <laughs> Subaru, bro. Oh yeah. Does he die? A lot. What? When? He gets his head chopped off once. He breaks his neck once. He messes with the girls of his squad for like a whole episode, and then they kill him after. Jesus. I think he's at like four deaths now, bro. I don't, I don't remember, remember that. that. Well, okay, I don't <laughs> right? remember that because I haven't I watched didn't... it. What the fuck? Huh? I didn't know that. Does he actually die? He did. Yeah, multiple times. Are you watching what the right thing? <laughs> the same thing. Yes, I'm watching the same thing. Cosmo, bro. Yeah, Cosmo. Cosmo. Dies he dies. Times. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, and then he goes to the uh, the other world and he meets the heiress, the yeah. other goddess. Yeah. The only way he can talk to goddess is if he's dead. Oh, I thought he just got truck and then that was, that was it. But uh, okay, <laughs> no. Remember, okay, so he got truck. No, he gets tractor heart attack kun uh -huh. at the uh, beginning, yeah. <laughs> and then Aqua's there. Then he's like, yeah. the only thing I want to take with me is Aqua. So then he goes to the other world, Aqua. Then Eris takes over. Mm -hmm. So every other time he talks to Eris, uh -huh. he's dead. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, okay. Noted. <laughs> because Aqua has resurrection, man. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Cool, okay. Uh, I, I have to start to watch season two, to be honest. I haven't, I've only seen season one. But Alan, oh, you've only seen season yeah. one. Yes. I think he only dies. He only dies once in season. Oh, one. Oh, okay, okay. That makes more sense. That's then. why you don't know. Yes, Alan, sir. Tell us about Tear Eternity. Oh, that's <laughs> also. Oof. Wait, that's also why you don't know how etchy it gets. Cause season two is way. Is that? Oh, too. yeah. I had no idea. That's why. Oops. Oh. I, thought, I didn't know you got that far that quickly. I'm not gonna say why I got that far, <laughs> but um, it requires me being paid uh -huh. to do something, and that also happening at the same time I'm mm. being paid to do other tasks. Anyways, continue. Gotcha, gotcha. To your eternity. Whoa, he's so old, and then he's young again. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So I who feel are these new characters? Yes. Oh. Wow. He asked me, and this is Andre does this all the time, where he just doesn't give a shit about my feelings, right? I feel like my feelings come second, uh, maybe even third in this podcast. No, I was setting it up for you. I didn't finish the whole that thing. That's really the trailer. Up. What more do you want? Want me to say now huh that's only the trailer. Like trailer it's like he's old he's because then he i guess he transforms out to transform again back he's young uh -huh. there's new mm -hmm. characters um and i forget all my theories i have to go back you didn't and, talk about his eye going from his normal eye color back to the normal boy's eye color well fuck it man i don't even care what does that mean it means i mean i don't know what it means 
What do you? How do I? How am I, how am I supposed to know what that means, man? Oh, whatever. <laughs> I, I can't wait. All right, that's what I'm gonna say. There Happy yeah. birthday. We're looking forward it to says it. says fall 2022. That's you it. didn't say that too. You could have said fall Bro, you, 2022. I had all of it ready, and then Feng Shui got moved around. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Alan, 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 Alan. How about we just pretend I didn't say anything? I can't. Just take it from the top. I can't. Take it from the top. Take it from the top. All right. Please. Hey, Alan. Uh, yeah, Trinity. Sean. Uh, was, oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, I, I feel like we <laughs> talked about this already, but um, um uh, you know, it's it's about uh, Fukushima, it's uh, Kurosuki Honda Civic. And uh, he's about to, yeah. uh, you know, uh, end of at, at end of season one, uh, we see him be really old, which is really cool. Yeah, um, and as we know, uh, if you guys watch or keeping up to our podcast, we did watch the first season. And every time he, he transforms from one to another, he goes into the, the state that he found them in or he changed yeah. from them. So uh, it just means that he did. He was forced to change, maybe to fight, maybe to run away. We don't know. As no one said, we do see his eyes uh, change from the fushi that we that has consciousness i guess we'll say that mm -hmm. to the other one that's kind of like doesn't remember or like the boy i don't know i don't know how to explain it um so uh, other than that we do see some other characters pop up that we don't know who they are really and then uh yeah fall fall tw this this fall which we can't wait for yay nice yeah it's, yeah. it's a lot quicker than i thought i thought i would um honestly like i don't i wasn't really fully aware of the reception in the first season guy i guess a lot of people liked it right oh yeah um, for sure but it's nice to see a second season done so quickly. I just hope it doesn't. I mean, we never really watched Your Eternity for the animation anyway. So it's a story you really focus on. The and character the characters. Yeah, yeah. We love characters. Yeah. But I, I hope the animation is uh, is decent enough to like be watchable. Unlike oh, some yeah. other ones. Like, oh, yeah. I, I, d I definitely think, I definitely think uh, it'll, be, it'll be decent. I got to go back and read. What was my like theory? What happened in the first? Oh, they're all dead. Rocket ship. But they're not dead because he's going to yeah. resurrect them. That's what it was. That was so theory. that's still going to happen. And then the rocket ship. Yeah. And then, um, and then the rocket ship goes and hits Mars. And then we find Elon Musk's uh, no, second child. Oh, he turns into a rocket ship. Yeah, he turns into yeah, a rocket ship. He's going to turn into a rocket ship. Whatever, man. <laughs> it's, it's, something, it's something like that. All right. God damn it. Um, I can't Fall wait. Fall twenty twenty two. Definitely. Though. Yeah, yeah we already said that. We already said that. All right. All right. <laughs> no, I know you already said, we already that, said that. I'm just saying. Reiterating. I'm reiterating. You can because reiterate this. this I'm kind of like surprised. It's so quick. I'm surprised that they're like committing to that. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It's like they put like a special place in their heart for two year eternity, and I'm really happy because it's like one of my yeah, favorite like, new ones I've seen in, in the last heart. couple of years. Yeah. <laughs> um. And I mean. I mean. At the same time, technically, that's when Chainsaw Man's supposed to be out. Mm. Bleach is supposed to oh, be out. Oh, shit. And Blue Lock are all supposed Jeez. to be out. Yo, apparently Blue Lock has the, uh, has the potential to be, like, the best sports anime, even better than Haiku and yeah. Kokoro, Kokono, Koko, Coconut Basketball or whatever it's called. Yo, Kuroko's Basketball is amazing. Fire, fire. Absolutely. No, no, I'm not even this thing. I just don't remember the name. But it, Blue Lock basketball. is about to is about to send that shit to the, to the Nether Realms. What is Blue Lock? Apparently, Blue Lock soccer is battle royale. Oh, uh, okay. Literally soccer <laughs> battle royale. It's Fortnite but with a soccer ball, right? Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Uh, I've I've heard good things, so we're mm -hmm. excited for that. But fall is shaping up to be quite. The... It is. Oh yeah, it is. that sounds good so far. I'm something to look forward to now. Definitely. <laughs> yeah. Other than Kingdom Hearts Four. In ten years, <laughs> yo. Hopefully they have like some. I, I know. I know it's the we idea made sucks. episode four hundred and fifty by the time. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know the idea sucks, but I always wanted some like multiplayer. Not multiplayer. Maybe like a co-op thing with like Kingdom Hearts because mm. I like solo. The mm. game's amazing. I just always thought yeah. like playing with friends would be cool. Like if I could be you goofy. Not not like again. Not the greatest. It wouldn't be the greatest thing. But like imagine like a Elden Elden Ring where you and a friend can like invade another person's like world and like kind of just like either help them or fight them yeah. i don't know why i kind of want that but whatever hopefully they learn you want to kick Sora's ass you want i just, just want to fucking beat the shit out of a mickey mouse looking <laughs> dude I, I swear man that's what i want that makes more sense all right guys that's amazing to finish up all the news of the week yeah elden ring still elden ringing witcher 3 next gen got delayed um Ooh. witcher 3 next gen yeah, you yeah. know how they do next gen patches for all like their uh, next gen patches. Yeah, why don't they just create a Witcher Four instead? They are. It was announced. It's just okay. It'll take a minute. Gotcha. Um. Oh, Tomb Raider. A new Tomb Raider game's also been announced. Oh, really? Unreal Engine Five. Nice. Using Unreal Engine Five. Um. Good shit. I think that's all the important stuff, really. Yeah. Uh, yeah Mario Golf right. is coming to NSO. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. 
All right. That's I it. think with that, we can get into the enemy. All right. Let's see. Unless, you guys, no. unless one of you guys have something else to say. I got nothing. No, it's pretty good. Yeah. All right. So we watched. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> We've watched four. Executioner, Shield Hero, Tomodachi Game, mm-hmm. and Spy Family. Yeah. Am I missing? Yeah, you're missing my girlfriend's not Summer just a ta- cutie. Yeah, and Love is War. I life. haven't <laughs> seen that one yet, bro. I'm sorry. Come on, man. <laughs> man. You're missing the other one, too. The Iowa, can't, um, Komi Can't Communicate 2, uh-huh. 4. No, 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 no. We will definitely talk about Komi Can't No, no, it's the other one, not Komi. There's another one now. She can't talk either. And the guy actually can't express feelings either. Oh. It's beautiful. Oh, anyway. is that the one with the little, the short girl? Yeah, that one kind of makes me kind of weird. But anyway, sorry, Andre. Keep going. <laughs> it is I watched that shit. Weird. And Summertime Rendering is actually going to come out this week. Mm. But we still can't talk about it because it comes out at the end of this week. So oh, yeah. next week. Someone went into the podcast. <laughs> next, next, week. Get there. next week we'll get there. But um, so I guess that's four. So let me break down the anime as we go. Um, start with Shield Hero because that was this easiest to summarize. Yeah, basically. basically. So at the end, we left off with our heroes in a giant hole after use the rage shield. Some random girl pops up and says, kill me. Then mm-hmm. she disappears. They have a meeting to figure out kind of how they're going to take down the spirit turtle. The girl shows up out of nowhere. She's like, actually, I'm a familiar about a spirit turtle. And I lied to you guys, all of you guys. And everyone's just like, OK, <laughs> everyone just kind of accepts it and moves on. <laughs> they're like, whatever. And then... Shield heroes like y'all are arguing. I'm tired of this. I'm gonna figure this out myself. He leaves. Raftalia gives him like an inspirational thing. They come together. They come to an agreement. They try and make a whole plan to take down the spirit turtle. They do that. Um, they have a camp, and then the spirit <clears throat> turtle shows up, and then to be continued. That's it. Jeez. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, so that's that. Uh, let's do executioners. Oh, are we just moving on from after? That? I'll, I'm just going to go through all four of them. Oh, you're going to go through all of them? Okay. okay. All four of them, and we'll just talk about what we feel so far. Okay. And then we can break them down as we go. Let's hear it. Okay. So, Executioner Way of Life, basically what happens is she... First of all, we find out that the maid outfit did indeed come in handy because she walked through the castle. Yeah, you're right. You're right. We just didn't see that. Yep. The, we just didn't see that at the end of the first episode. No, Anyways, so she does that. She jumps on the balcony as before. She sees the girl. Um, she comes up with some elaborate lie to get the girl to follow her. The girl believes her. They run away. And then everyone in their mind is thinking, oh my God, they're going to fall in love. It's fine, whatever. She's not going to do anything. But instead of that, she's just like, nah, man. I got a job to do. Stabs her immediately in the Uno back reverse. of the neck. Legit, yeah. <laughs> Everyone's like, oh, damn, what the heck? But then we find out she has a super OP move where mm-hmm. she can turn back time. Yo, these basically where he meant. These isekai people have the friggin' best freaking abilities. The yeah. first guy can erase anything. Oh, yeah. And this girl can has 100% control over time even after she's dead. Yeah, too bad she, she can still turn back time. It's a shame that she killed the guy because he probably could have killed her. <laughs> Yeah, that, nullify. Is, right? that, that is true. true. That is true. That is very that is true. So true. Anyways, yeah. so um, she comes back to life, and then she's like flabbergasted. She's like, "What the hell am I supposed to do, old lady?" The old lady's like, "Don't worry, bring her to this place. We'll we have like a special thing that can basically Kill destroy you. any <laughs> other world there." So then she makes up this journey and like okay we're gonna mm. take the train and we're gonna make it there and then the girl's like oh my god i have to help this little girl and she's like don't use your powers you're gonna get caught and then makes bubbles and then this girl with no mm-hmm. coat clothes on is the princess or something and she shows up <laughs> she's like we got to go to the same place that the main characters are going to mm-hmm. and then and that's yeah that's pretty much pretty it. much yeah that's, I mean, <laughs> and that's then pretty much it. <laughs> and then what was the other one? Not Tomodachi. Well, oh, Spy Family. Yeah. Which is the first episode oh, of Spy Family. So this good. is probably... Fire. I don't know. This is like a mixture between like Slice of Life versus like like action yeah. versus like... I don't know. This is like all of the great anime mixed into one anime. It's great. But basically, this guy, he's a super spy. He's a master of disguise. He can... He's mixes. He works for... Twilight. He works for this agency. <laughs> he gets a bunch of important documents from a lot of people. He's also good at fighting. But... Um, he gets a uh, assignment basically that he has to get really close to this um, important um, po- political guy. It seems mm-hmm. like, and then in order to do that, he has to basically create a family and get his 
get his child through school in order to get through get to this important guy so he goes to this random freaking orphanage and he's like oh i gotta find the sketchiest orphanage possible so they don't have papers um finds this girl this girl turns out to be a telepath she can read minds so she <laughs> has her own issues because she's been passed around so she does everything possible basically she reads her she reads the guy's mind in order so he doesn't like give her away basically she yeah. tries to do everything she can to not make him give her away um she doesn't know she's bored at home because he locks her in there he freaking <laughs> she plays with the freaking morse code thing accidentally sends a signal to the main bad guys that are looking for him so she gets kidnapped <laughs> then the guy's like oh my god i'll just let her go but come on guys it's episode one you so have a whole anime to do you can't leave the girl there nah. so right. obviously he uses his master of disguiseness Kills the people basically, or like traps them. The ones that attacked him goes into the main bad guy's lair, takes the girl and runs away and escapes. And he tells the girl to run and find an orphanage. You'll get into a good house now because I have this letter. But then she's like, No, I want to stay with him. So after he finishes up, he comes back. She's there, and then they hug. And then they're like, Oh my gosh, daddy. And he's like, Oh my gosh, I found this woman, but I can't. He's like, I can't care too much because I'm spot. <laughs> this is just a fake kid I don't care yeah, yeah, yeah. but then they she finally decides to to study she gets into the school and then they have a happy fun time and they're like yay you made it into school <laughs> she's happy he's happy everyone's happy but he's confused because he's like I'm a spy bro I'm supposed to be freaking cold hearted and like a badass I'm not supposed to love my kid and then ends there mm-hmm. yeah we love it and yeah. then finally Tomodachi game um so we left off panties he talked blah 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 blah. (laughs) we get a lot of more um conversation between the people um so after he talks he keeps talking keeps going he keeps asking questions everyone's trying their hardest not to answer his questions uh the game ends because he basically says obviously we're gonna stay friends forever so then whoever the traitor is now is kind of like Oh shit! Like <laughs> they're basically gonna figure out who they are if they don't basically go to yes. So he's kind of yeah. confused because he bluffed about what the card said about mm-hmm. the lowest, about the lowest um, debt being doubled, whereas yeah. it was the, actually the highest debt being doubled, right? Yeah. So then it goes to the right answer. They clear the game. Then what's her face? One of the girls comes in. I don't remember. She's black hair. Black hair girl comes in. She. He, he decides to be sneaky. He's like, I'm going to read the cards, but then the ink fades. The black hair girl comes in. There she's, He's like, yo, I think it's you. She's like, nah, man, I like you. Can't be me. My <laughs> my debt actually doubled. And then he's like, girl, my my debt have then doubled, so it's the same. <laughs> Which I also... I is didn't that really get true? that. I, no, no, I, I, he lied. He lied. He definitely lied. I, I don't think that was true. So he uh, has he has basically the same debt as the black girl. Correct, correct, yeah. That's I mean, I not the black girl, the black-haired girl, <laughs> I should say, right? But that's only if she's telling the truth. Yeah, correct, yeah. I, which I don't, right? I don't, I don't, I don't believe. <laughs> oh, well, I think right, your debt so went up because she's the one who was betraying them. But okay, go on, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, so she she at the beginning of the last episode, she like kind of let out a little scream. She claims that that doubled her yeah. debt because they aren't supposed to make any noise. Mm. Uh, um, then she says, I like you, so like you have to believe me. And then he's like, what the hell's going on? And then they go to another game where basically they have to write bad things about each other. And then they continue along like a like a board, like a board game style. They continue to the end. And each space has like different conditions, whether they add debt to add to their debt or take mm-hmm. away from their debt or don't change to their debt. Mm-hmm. Um, and the whole thing is there's like a the people watching can vote on it and then the person who's most popular moves the least amount of spaces and the goal is to reach the end first because everyone else that's on the bo- no the last person on the board doubles their debt is that what it was yeah or yeah. adds a certain number to their what debt you, wait hold on, hold on what do you mean most popular no it's the one who people vote most for they they go ahead the most spaces yeah no no first place you go you move according to the amount your place so first place Score only moves one space. Yeah, the, with the lowest Second score. Second place moves two spaces. 
third place moves three spaces, four fourth place moves four spaces. Yeah, so five, so wait, so you're saying spaces. yeah, yeah, the one that loot moves the lowest though <coughs> is the one that doesn't get any votes. They don't because they don't like their lie. Yeah, so whoever yeah. has the least amount of votes moves yeah, okay, the okay. most spaces. Perfect, perfect. No. So thought, it's kind of like inverted in the sense where you think you'd win because you're most popular, right. but you actually move the least amount of spaces. Right, right, right. Okay, okay. Right. Good, good, good. Um. Anyways, so they try that. That was the most complex part. I don't yeah. know if I understand it completely, but that's essentially what it was. Um, but it starts out, they all move in blank, so they all move space after space, and they all just collect in the debt. Until Mr. Glasses Man, oh. who was listening in, I forgot to say that before, but Mr. Glasses Man was listening in, and he heard that the black-haired girl likes the main character. Um, so there was a random card in there out of us, out of nowhere that said, hey... Um, she likes the main character and the glasses man and black hair girl are like, we used to date basically on the card. So obviously everyone's going to be like, what the hell? Why did you put that in there? You're the only one who would know. Yeah, right. So then there's like a whole fight. Then, well, first it was just that she likes the main character. So then mm-hmm. Blondie is like, I've got to fight you. Why did, are you messing with me? Why did you want to got to fight? And then the second part was like, Oh, but she also like, she also dated glasses, man. And then they fight. We learned that their relationship was fake or something. <laughs> um, they continue going on. Then everyone just like, you know what? Free for all. Now everyone just starts talking shit about everybody. Yeah. And then people are moving different spaces. Um, I'm gonna forget the very end of the. Episode the very end is like um the night. the girl that likes our main character yeah. is kind of is kind of jealous that all oh, the boys like her. The, right. The so girl. um she started acting weird, like kind of before she was like kind of like looking like odd and she's like why is she, like so sh-? like at the beginning when um main character and the black hair girl were like looking at each other she was like looking and then she walked up to the black hair girl and she's like oh my gosh all the boys like you i wish they can like me basically and then at the end once we find out all that stuff happens she like freaking yeah what was up with that it's just screaming i don't know that was weird. i i, th- I don't think, and i, I don't knew think we know what, what i think the li- a lie came out and then uh, we didn't get to hear it yet like i think someone said yeah. something about her that is terrible and like she like kind of freaked out but oh, we don't is know that yet. what you think it i was? think i think or she literally just mentally broke and she doesn't want to play anymore gotcha. um i the reason why i'm like kind of iffy on that piece okay i guess that means uh that's all for anime that we watch i guess we're starting with tomodachi game because that's the most interesting yeah. okay so in that instance Listen, wait, wait, first of all, no, first no, no, and foremost, but I think back, we should do... Back, let's go back to the beginning of the episode. Let's talk okay, about, like... Yeah, but yeah. I want to say, for Tomodachi Game, I think what we should do is we should have our suspect of the week type thing. Ooh. Uh, and we should we should each, at the end of every episode, just say oh. who we think has the debt okay, okay. or who okay, we think okay. the traitor okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Please, and this is there's perfect. another question, though. Do we think the traitor is the same person who has the debt? Because that's not guaranteed either. Wait, wait, wait. Um, um, uh, you uh, you got to talk about it. Hold on. 33. This is going to be called Sussy Baka se- segment. <laughs> Perfect. So I, I initially thought it was the glasses dude, but I thought it was weird that um he was like antagonizing everyone, you know? I guess he was kind of cheesed that he knew that she liked the black girl, black haired girl liked our MC. Yeah. But at the same time, I was like, bro, like you're in a situation here. Get over it. Uh, move on. And it just, just seems like they're friends. Like, I know, but chill, man. He likes him, bro. <laughs> Low key, I do the same shit too. I'd be so petty as fuck. I'd be like, yo. That, Dude, you should have told her so long ago then. And even the the blonde hair guy, I agreed with. He's like, yo, you should have said something if you were into her. And he thing didn't is, like. like you know, you know the you know the anime trope where the guy with the glasses is, is like pretty smart as well. Yeah. So I I think maybe um that he has a little plan in in, in the back of his mind too. I mm-hmm. I don't know for sure, but I'm hoping like he's like. I just we just need to like progress with these games so that we can get out as fast as possible or yeah. else we are actually going to like mess up bad here. So, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I, I feel like he's so smart. Do you but guys do you guys think he's the one who put the paper in? Considering it's yeah, technically so. speaking, he's the only one yeah. who should know oh, all yeah. the information that mm. was in the paper. And he, even though he specifically said he's like why would I do it? That would make me yeah. suspect. So I bad. know. I think I still think it was him cuz like also, why would you confirm that it's the truth? I would be like, oh, no, I totally don't feel that way. Just to make it a lie, basically. Um, 
But see, that's the thing. It's kind of like a reverse psychology type thing where he would be like, oh, that is totally the truth. But also, why would I put that on there if it's the truth? Because I would just give myself away type thing. You yeah. Know what I mean, so he's kind of saying he made an obvious error. Yeah. So no one would suspect him because everyone else would be like, why would he do that? Well, you who else I mean? would know that he loves the black haired girl? Yeah. yeah so I, I hear you, Alan. You can go. <laughs> so there's so many hand emojis on my screen now. Um, what I what I was what I was thinking is that so, for, uh, I think I think that this game is definitely towards um, them because they people know of them, like the people who made the games know of these these friend groups, and um, I think what I think you know like the last game where the thing that kept moving like to the wrong answer and all that stuff yeah um i think it could have think about it Ma- magnet right under the table the I game see. the gamers want the gamers want it to be a little spicy so they move it mm-hmm. to obviously the answer they don't want now their group showed the most uh, potential for entertainment because as mm-hmm. we know it's being streamed so uh when when our got when our boys like yo where the where the panties at um the people who are watching up there mikasa and girl um <laughs> Obviously, there's viewers they can see. So the game people are probably like, "Yo, we got to keep these guys in." They are pretty much shambles when it comes to their friendship. People would love to see them. So I think with this game, you never know because it's going into a box that only one person can be there at a time. In between mm-hmm. people switching in and out, you never. They could just he could put his hand in, and it could be like a totally like fabricated stuff that the game people know about them. So mm-hmm. it could be that as well. I, I, I hope it's not that because that's kind of scummy. I really do hope there's like a like an infiltrator and like a, a yeah, like yeah. a traitor. But it could be that. It could be that. They just want to see who, who stays and who goes type thing. Mm-hmm. Okay. Honestly, um, looking throughout the whole thing, like almost the entire time, obviously there was like a like an like an obvious like first part where I was like, okay, the black herd girl mad suspicious right off the bat right off the bat, but then yeah. kind of from last episode i was kind of suspicious of the friggin other girl the one that's like seems so innocent yeah. kind of thing yeah and They're then true. i was true. even more suspicious of her the entire time as she was going because everyone was friggin freaking out emotions high and the whole time she's just like chilling in the back <laughs> saying yeah. nothing yeah. not doing anything uh. but then at the end when she freaked out I'm just like, that looks weird. Yeah, and like, like it kind of <laughs> turned, like, I'm like, that turned me away actually from suspecting her. Oh, okay. Interesting. Because she uh, did that. Okay. Because not because I don't believe she could have done it. It's literally because now it looks kind of too obvious that it was her and she's just unstable. <laughs> 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 yeah. That it would be fair. her. So that's I'm fair. like, but this could be like a whole like VV freaking tack top thing where we're trying oh, to yeah. dig in deep to like a whole convoluted story where yeah. it's just like <laughs> I know, in front I know. of us real easily, right? Yeah. So I don't know if I'm overanalyzing. Yo, what would it be like if it was the main character the entire time and they just weren't showing us like that? that side that's another option. Like, I don't it know. is an option. That'd be so know. weird. <laughs> it's just like he's act- well, we've seen like be we've even seen cool at the show. end of the first one like he has a kind of crazy side to him, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's sure. like, oh, I see some potential. Like that, yeah, that would be. Definitely. I've never seen definitely. anything that would that has done that before. So it would be interesting. But I also think it's kind of like, like it would be. It would be hard to do. I feel like it'd be hard to do well. Um, but I, I mean, it's an option, like you said. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I, I, I also feel. I also feel like this is like probably one of the better shows out of our. Uh, yeah. Uh, our our yeah. picks here, or like the sorry, not our picks, but like the animes that come out. Um, mm-hmm. Me and Andre were talking about before you came, but there's so many shows this season that like have pretty much good potential. Like yeah. if think about it, if VV was in in this lineup, we'd watch it as well because it had a great start and had a great premise. Mm-hmm. So I mm-hmm. hope we just I guess like for the next couple of weeks we're gonna have to just like really dissect these things and see which ones kind of yeah. make it to the end. Like Shaman King, right to the end, right? So um, always, always right. Shaman King's still here to this day. We're still we're still on episode four. Um, <laughs> Well, I don't know, but this Tomagachi, Tomagachi gaming s- stuff. I, I, I love the friggin' like host dude, like how he changes oh, yeah. his like his his appearance. Um, so and funny. he was like there, he was like their elder or like their senpai or whatever. He's like the teacher, yeah, or like the teacher or something like that. Yeah, it was it was it was funny. And he got like he got upset with them, like and he's like, don't talk about whatever. He said something, and I was just like, oh, this is hilarious. Yeah. Um, I love how the main character was like, he was just like going on and on. He's just like, yo, you talk too much. Yeah, he's like, oh, my bad. <laughs> yeah. 
like, oh, Are you well, talking? Just... You talk too much. Like, oh, it's okay. <laughs> oh man, that must have been felt so good for him too, because like not only did he save his friend by talking, but he like got to talk and just like shit on everyone, and they can't yeah. say anything. <laughs> And see, this is the issue also, I want to say with my theory that it's the innocent girl. Yeah. What incentive would she have had to mess up the game? Because she was the last person. Technically, she wouldn't have seen the cards. Mm -hmm. Unless, again, she... Because remember, they all got knocked out and appeared there. Yeah. Like, we have no idea what happened between yeah. them getting knocked out or even before that. She could be, you think she could be a part of the game? And them waking, and then the main character waking up and everyone else was awake already. Yeah. Like, there could have been like full conversations going on beforehand. Because mm -hmm. if you think about it, when the guy first came in, nobody was surprised. No one was like, what the hell? There's like a freaking moving doll thing. Yeah. What the <laughs> Nobody was like astonished at yeah. this thing. Just walked in and started talking. Yo, so I feel like the they... guy actually looks like that. That'd be crazy. Yeah, they definitely seen Squid Game, so they're cool with anything. <laughs> yeah, they're like, oh, okay. I mean, it looks like they've seen that that guy already, right? Uh, That's what it looks like. So. Yeah, That's true. I don't know. Interesting. Well, one know. thing I would watch out for is if um is if that girl is continuously <laughs> like the one who's going to get like screwed by the game. Then it might even seem like a, a test of like, oh, are you? Do you have good friends that would like save you in this crisis? Like that would take that debt off your shoulders? Because if it's her, if it's her debt to begin with, I mean, so yeah. it, like it might be just a test of like how how good are your friends to you? Like, yeah. are you worth like protecting and saving to your friends? Yeah. And uh, yeah, and also just for entertainment purposes. Yeah. So 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 far with with like what they've shown us. Um, we did get, we did have connections with, uh, main character and black haired girl because black haired girl likes him. We also mm -hmm. have connections with the, the innocent girl because innocent girl likes him. Um, mm -hmm. but then we, we only saw one other backstory with the glasses guy and the black haired girl where I can see why he would want to kind of like mess things up. But also again, the same reason with the, um, what's, what's that guy from my hero, the electric dude, I can't remember his name now, but he looks like that guy. Um, the yellow haired guy, blonde guy. Um, and he yeah. likes, he likes black haired girl. And now you can see that why he would want to mess things up. So yeah. I don't, if anything, it actually comes down to black haired girl being the one that messes things up because the other two literally had no incentive until now. Right. Yeah. Or main character. Uh, if she, he's a, if he's, if he's a dickhead. What do you think? Do you think because it's also possible that the black haired girl knew that blonde guy and glasses guy liked her. Mm -hmm. So she kind of manipulated them. Uh, true. And then... They do be doing she that. Went, and then she went to the MC and told her, told him that she liked him. Oh, just to like... Kind of manipulate ooh. him. Yeah, because what fucking idiot puts a bag of money in a locker? Are you mentally <laughs> unstable? Like, what? That's her. That's on her. I don't care who's yeah, crying. Yeah, That's yeah. on her. Yeah. And uh, um, yeah... I, I would say that for our pick for who we think it is right now is the black haired girl because I think that she also ding, ding, I was ding, trying ding, to figure ding, out if she was just trying to come up with a good excuse for why her um, her debt went up and I thought it might have been due to something else and she was lying like I don't yeah. think she actually made a sound and that's why it went up I thought it went up because maybe she was in a position in the game where her card said something that like maybe screwed with her numbers yeah, yeah, but we also don't know for sure if it went up. Yeah, I know. So I have no idea. <laughs> so I just don't trust her. And um, as of right now, I think it's her. Yeah, well, that, that's why I can't really suspect our main character because he we actually see everything of his. We see his debt. Mm -hmm. We see his mindset. We yeah. see all that. So like, I don't think it's main character. That'd be too big okay. brain for them to do. <laughs> okay. I will say, um, like, I, like, when I first went to university, like, we played this game, basically, where there's, like, I don't remember what the game is called. Basically, like there's one like bad guy, and then like every like there's a group of people, and you have to try to figure out what the bad guy was. Mm -hmm. Like the fatal mistake I made when I was a bad guy is like I didn't talk. I like barely yeah. talked at all the entire mm -hmm. time. Yeah. And then as soon as I was a bad guy, all of a sudden I just started like talking. I just started like talking, like engaging in everything, like trying to like blame it on other people and shit. Mm -hmm. So like mm -hmm. literally the first thing they said, is, they're like, "You haven't talked this whole time," and all of a sudden you're like, chatty mouth. So it was definitely you. Oh, and I'm, like, fuck. Shit. <laughs> so like I'm thinking I'm thinking the reason why the black hair girl seems so suspicious is she's literally all of a sudden she's literally she's just the one who's just like talking to this person talking to that person she's like trying to express all these different things to different people and just mm -hmm. like get her side across mm -hmm. but at the same time she was like I guess the student council president or whatever so like it's not 
it's also not weird that she would be the type of person to talk and like be like mm-hmm. out there and like open yeah people and whose father did they say uh passed away was it the glasses guy's father the glasses yeah, yeah. Guy. okay okay like I was gonna I, say, like maybe there's I, some connection. I don't there, think too. it's him. Like I, I get it. Like he had past, past relationships with this girl, but there's no. He look. He's too calm and collective. He, I, he's too calm and collective. He doesn't care. He's like, he's like, fuck it. I'm in this. I'm gonna figure this out. How to get out of here? And it just so happens that you know he he's now being singled out. Mm-hmm. Um, to me, it's black haired girl until blonde guy gives me a reason to hate him because as of right now, he's the rich dude. Um, uh, and he and you know. Money. I mean, there's multiple reasons to hate him. Already. Oh yeah, he's he's just a dickhead in general. But you never know; he could have some sad backstory where he needed because he's used to being rich. And you know, yeah. you know, people from not the struggle. I'm not saying I am, but you know, people from not the struggle. As soon as they lose a little bit, it's the mm-hmm. it's it's everything. Yeah. So he could have stole the money. Everything's comparison. Right? That's right. Yeah. So he could he could have stole the money, and I don't know. But yeah. as of right now, Black Girl Girl is uh, is our saucy baka. Uh, I really hope it's not the blonde guy because in my experience, like that's the most obvious uh, yeah. pick. Like the rich guy who's not now not rich and stealing money and has money issues. That I just like really his mom's dying and he needs like keep like they yeah. don't have enough money, so he thought Something he like could. That. And then he enrolled them into like yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't. It's too much of an anime trope to do I that, but see- we are watching yeah. an anime. <laughs> I want to say shy girl is it so bad, bro? I want to say it's shy girl. Okay, is so bad. okay. So Ooh, you got Andre. Andre. Let's hear it. I'll do Andre. But I don't have like a, I don't have like an actual reason. Andre Literally up girl. until, up until the end part, I was like, like it seemed so heavily that it was shy girl. Mm. That's fair though. But it's so early, man. Se- first, second episode. It's 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 impossible. Fuck it. This is like, the whole you point. You guys are on black hair girl. I'm going out on the limb. I'm saying shy girl. Is okay. Right. So yeah. me and Sean. There you go. And second question though. That's what we think is the traitor, mm-hmm. but do we think oh, who, who do we stole think the money? Has a debt? Oh no, no, debt. not even that. Who do we think has? Oh a yeah, debt? that's the whole point. Twenty thousand, twenty whatever, or two million, whatever. Same How person, much was it? A... You think same person? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I would. Uh, yeah, I would. I'm gonna keep it simple and go same person. I'm going, I'm going same person. Okay, okay, so so shy. So shy girl traitor shy girl. slash thief or debt. Sorry. Yeah. Thief debt. Wow, okay. you guys picked all the women, eh? Sexist. Um, one hundred, one hundred percent. Yes, I'm not even gonna shy away from this. Yes. I did do that. Did do that. And we'll just say Sussy Baka. All right, perfect. Last question. Last question. Is, yeah. Is the person with the debt slash is the traitor also the person who stole the money? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think so. Be. I don't see why you, someone would steal it and not. Unless they want to cover themselves. Oh, they could cover themselves. What if up they just stole now? the money because they wanted to have this game? To take away someone else's debt. That's a blonde guy, dude. That guy's a dickhead. I don't know. I'm. I. I it's, that's too intricate for my brain right now. So I also wouldn't be surprised if, like, the blonde guy say like stole the money as like a prank joke, and then <laughs> lost it, and then like actually got robbed for the money. Oh man! By Bob the Builder. <laughs> Yo, that's what I'm saying, man. You never know, Bob. Yeah. Bob. Yeah, Bob could okay. be in there. He's in some debt. Bob, Bob, this week, it's him. He's in debt. This week, I'm Bob. saying, same for all three. Okay. Same, 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 here. same here. Same here. So me and Sean are and same. Same with the black haired girl, and then Andres yeah. is shy girl. Well, I, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm, you know, I'm, next week I am gonna change it to Bob. I'm. I'm. I'm thinking about doing Bob. Bob is the reason why they're here. He <laughs> He's knew. not just a game master. He caused everything. And, he, and, he, and you, know, you know who Bob is? Actually, one of the teachers, just to g- make their friendship better. Because this is gonna wrap up and be like, this is why you should have be nice to your friends and blah blah blah. Like I don't know some bullshit. Um, um, I thought it was yeah. funny too. Um, like last time we talked about how uh, they were being nice about whoever had the debt and create and had this game start because like oh they all think it's the poor guy and that <laughs> and they're just like not trying not to be like like hurtful towards him and then freaking like we we thought that he felt like shit because they were doing that to him but then freaking this episode she like brings it up oh I thought it was you because he's like because I'm poor. <laughs> And then I was like, oh, did you not, like, realize that when it happened? <laughs> like, that they all thought uh, it was you? Because <laughs> you're poor? Literally, like, yeah. you, you sound, like, super offended now. Like, it wasn't... Yeah, how did that not click? So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but Or maybe it was just, like, carrying a word from before. But it, it seems yeah. to me like she didn't realize that's why they they all were nice about it. Yeah, yeah. Or at least she was. But, um, yeah, I, I wanted to bring up a point, too. Like, this kind of takes away from the anime in general. But, like, under what authority am I being given debt by whom? Yeah, yeah. Like who's who? How do I just have debt now? Like who took? Yeah, it? 
<laughs> like, 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 show me the legal like legality <laughs> of this. Like, who, who, who's going to make me pay for this? Bro, yeah. imagine in grade 10, someone just brought you to, like, the Gatorade Center and said, you have to play these games because you're $2 million in debt. Yeah. You'd be like, you'd be like, Fuck you, I'm leaving. And you just let me walk the other way and just leave. Basically. Yeah, but it could be like Squid Game. Um... I, I, I have seen no one get like, shot yet. Yeah, no. No, no, not that. I know, I know. But it could be like Squid Game, like Loan Sharks type debt. You know what I mean? Like there's no one technically. I mean, technically you don't have to pay the debt if you can escape. Yeah, but those people those already kneecaps. have debt before they go in. The poor guy, the the, the literally our main character is already yeah. poor, and they're like, "Yeah, we're adding two million dollars of debt in onto you to play this <laughs> shit." <laughs> like, Who do I you even owe the money to? Like yeah. what? You, you have to pay yeah. Bob and like bi-weekly <laughs> payments. Like what? Crazy. Oh man. Crazy. Nice. Yeah, man. Well, I'm excited to see what we got. Yeah, me too. I I'm That's actually fun. like I look forward to this one. Like. Like, this yeah. felt like a slightly slower episode, and then when it ended, I was like, I need more, come on. Yeah, it, yeah. Like, I need it. Because it, it, like, it was slow, and then they, like, ramped yeah. it up, and then she screams, uh-huh. and then you're at your peak, and you're like, uh-huh. you're like, ah! And then, yeah, no. It's, uh, I'm, I'm, this is going to be definitely, if, uh, you know, as we're ruling them out for right now, mm-hmm. I can say this is going to be one of the ones that stay, obviously, yeah, with Spy X Family, because that and shit's going to be busting. very hard not to read it, but carry on. What the fuck? How it... Oh, come on, Sean. I'm not going to read it. We're on I'm episode two, and this guy already <laughs> fucking... I won't read it. Don't worry. Like, like, every day goes by, and I just remember he read, like, read Jujutsu. He read this. He read that. Oh, I'm just like, come on, man. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. To he, your eternity. You're, you're the read. reason why he read it. Tokyo Revengers, he read. Am I not wrong, Andre? You're, he's the reason why you Attack started reading Titan, Jujutsu. He read oh, Jesus my. Slayer, well, no, no. Read. I didn't know him at the time. That's not his fault. But now, yeah. like, think about matter. it. He was Now he's my virtual online friend, and he's still... What, uh, he still read it behind my back. All these shows that we started talking about. The only, only one. one I've read. The only ones I read was Demon Slayer and Tokyo. Olympics. No, he read another one. He read it. You, Sean, you read another one that pissed me off. To your eternity. Yes, bro. Come I on, didn't read man. I only read like three chapters. I actually didn't read that much. And also, was it good? Was it in good? my defense, good, right? the only yeah. reason, <laughs> the only reason I read Jujutsu Kaisen is because Alan said he read it. Did I, I, did I say Ow. I You it? said, I know you didn't read it, but you said that you read it, and then Sean said he read it. So, and so, like, so, I, so I, I, said, it. I said, fuck it, I'm going to read it too. You, so I read I, it, and then I busy. said, oh, I read it, Come and Alan's on, like, what the hell? Why'd you read it? And I was like, what do you mean? You, said you, you said you read it. <laughs> I just said it as a joke. You're right. Alan's yeah, busy. but you always do that shit, and then... Lead other people to my bad man, just like your freaking Jujutsu Kaisen movie. Movie. I saw it, and then you all of a sudden now you're telling me your joke. Now I don't know what to believe. I still don't, I still don't know if you went that day. They'll never know. This is just this is this is it, man. Never know. That's it. Suddenly, you guys are going to be in the Powerade Center again with two million dollars debt in your account, and it's because of me. (laughs) I'm not going to say anything. (laughs) You'll just push it to the no every time. That's it. Just yeah, yeah, it's Andre Black. Like, no, no. If I'm ever in their same situation and oh, you're man. there, I'm 100% leaving. <laughs> I'm not playing this game. Fuck you, bro. And I, because I know it's Allen's too. Yeah. Just pay oh, yeah. It yeah, yeah right. Whatever, man. I'm in debt already. I'll fucking go down just to see what see what happens. I'm I'm in debt. Hopefully we're not in a Squid yeah, Wave, Squid Games one because I actually kill you guys. Like not even on purpose. I by accident somehow kill my own teammates. Even oh, yeah. though we were teaming. Um, but like, <laughs> uh, you know, you know the one where they jump on the glass things and like they can only push. hold two people. Yeah. Allen would just be like, I don't know what to do, and then jump, be the third person on the glass. And- yeah, like I know it's safe, but I get nervous. I jump on the oh glass and both on just to kill everyone. And then I, in shoot, the running I'm stupid, one, man, I'm stupid. The, I would do that. In the running one, when the guy fell forward and and the brown guy behind him caught him, Alan would like catch you and then like drop you, like right when the thing turns around and be like, ah shit, ah oh, shit, <laughs> fuck, <laughs> my bad. Figure strength, man. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, really good, really good show. I, I can't wait for next week. I can't wait to talk about it. Yeah, um, are we going on to a next interesting one? We're going to Spy X Family. Yeah, Spy hey, Family. Sure. Let's do Spy it. Spy right. Family. Let's do it. All right. Dude, so, what uh, do you guys feel about Andre? It? Recap. Oh, yeah, no, yo, <laughs> bussin. Andre. Uh, Andre recap that so beautifully. I yeah. love. I love it because it's it's different. Um, mm-hmm. it, it is different. It's got the little, like Andre said, it's got the vibe of Slice of Life, but with mm-hmm. the action sequence of like an action anime. And no, no, no crazy powers, you know, just a guy who's fighting. It, it feels yeah. like like a 
a, a Jason Statham movie. You know, you how do you say his name? Fuck it, whatever. Mm-hmm. That guy. Um, I love it. I love it. I love the dynamic of the of the main character because he's someone yeah. that has trauma, as we found out in this first episode. Can't wait to find out about that. I'm assuming he had no family, and this is the whole point of the show. Mm-hmm. Um, and I can't wait to see who they pick for mom. I do have a theory that because he he is a spy for the West, um, he, the his mom is going to be the spy for the East, uh, and they're going to be working against you each think other. Like Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Yeah, yeah, like a, a little Mr. and Mrs. Yeah. Smith. But then what Fucking. connects them and what makes them like each other so much is Anya, and Anya is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. Um, very, 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 very wholesome uh, character. Mm-hmm. She just wants to. She just wants to be a spy. And she, again, t- a tele telepathic girl that is just trying to please someone um, is is really is really cool. Un, uh, no. Unlike that one TikTok guy, I don't like him, and I don't know why he's. Yeah, let's not said. talk about. That. Yeah, we're not yeah, going to go into it. But that that, one. like, let's imagine move. imagine not knowing anything and then opening your mouth. I mean, that's me half the time. But I know when to shut it. Like, you know what I mean? Anyway, that guy pissed me off. Um, <laughs> Yeah, Goku still solos though. That's fine. All right. Um, yeah, I th- I literally like it so far. Um, mostly for me, like the action didn't appeal to me as much, but just the the characters and the dynamic. Yep. And um, mm-hmm. his internal monologue, I just think is really like captivating and interesting. And that's actually very similar to the internal monologue in uh, in Love Is War. It's, it's it's a lot like that. And he actually even looks like the main character in that. Yeah. But, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's it's just a very it's a very cute so far. Um, the the girl's hilarious. She's just adorable and. Uh, yeah, it's just I can't wait to see how it's gonna go. I like I like the piece that like how he has his internal monologue. Yeah, and we're not the only ones who can hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. fucking little girl can hear it too. Bro. Like breaking the fourth wall. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah. Really I, I I want them to like um like have her like pan over to the camera and just note it like have her notice us. Be like, just be like. Yeah, be like, because she keeps saying Papa's a liar. Right? Yeah, so oh, she's yeah. gonna be like, she's just, one day yeah, she's, she's just gonna look over, like the little office gym, gym at the <laughs> office, just look over the camera, and just like, yeah, yeah, you know what? Um, Her expressions I can't, are hilarious. So too. what's gonna be so crazy? And and think about it is that um, when we get when we get to meet mom, um, like. Mm-hmm. Of course, they're gonna like each other. You know anime, and you know anime tropes. They're gonna like each other, but they can't show it. But the, again, like Andre just said, the little girl is gonna know, and the little mm-hmm. girl is gonna do everything she can to keep them together. To keep them together, so that oh, she has she has parents, yeah, I didn't right? Even consider that. Yeah, that's definitely probably. It's gonna be <laughs> awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, ca- great character development, more than Tamagotchi uh, from Tokyo Revengers already. Um, yes, she's a telepath, and she she relies on others. Honestly, both of them freaking had more character development oh, I mean, one yeah, episode. Yeah. My, my yeah. fucking toenail did the whole my anime. toenail grew a millimeter and that was more than uh, Tamaguchi in, uh, since season well, chapter yeah. one um, for you guys. Uh, uh, but I was going to say she literally uh, is a te- uh, tele- telepathic person but she had to rely on her own knowledge uh, during the test and that was huge. She's never done that before. Like she mm. was trying to listen in to get answers um, for the entrance exam, and uh, she really couldn't because every, everyone's like, oh, everyone is useless. Yeah, and that one girl's like, eeny, meeny, but that's literally me. Like I'm just like, and she literally was like, oh, I remember, you know, studying with dad, and I'm I still cheating, use, but which is still cheating, right? But um, but like still, she used her own. Why thoughts. is that cheating? She, she studied for the test. She didn't study. She had the oh, answers. Oh, he had the answers. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he just like memorizes the from the guy. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's it's character growth, man. You, you, you got, He's a spy, dog. That's right. He's a he fucking can, spy. What he does what he does. I even noticed that. He's the best my, spy in the world. My girlfriend pointed out. She's like, "Oh, she knew the answers from before." And I'm like, "No, she didn't." And then we went back. And I'm like, "What the fuck? I didn't notice this." <laughs> God damn! I can't read. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, but yeah, no, I'm mad excited for that mad one. Mad excited. Yeah. So good. Oh, and uh Cloverworks and who? Other one. Wit. Wit. They're flip they're it's flip. Wit, I think. No, it's both. It's both. So it's Cloverworks and Wit. So Oh, they're doing like um like tacked off how they switch. Yeah, but back they're, and forth? exactly. They're gonna do one, three, five, seven, whatever, and then the uh Cloverwork or whoever's doing it next does two, four, six, eight. Cloverworks is go to I think they did um Black Clover if I don't know. Oh yeah, yeah. No, they're both they're both fantastic. Both uh, top top anime animation companies. Yeah, I like Cloverworks, yeah, but I could be lying. Now Clover. I have to look it up, so I'm not a friggin' loser. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't I don't watch Black Clover either. Did you read it, Sean? Did you read Black Clover? No, I haven't watched it yet. Nah, no. Oh, Clove Cloverworks did, um, Promise Neverland, hmm. Horror Mia. She guess guess what? Vivi. Guess what anime from no. last season that they did. Evie? Cloverworks? No, no. From last season. Did we watch Shaman it? King. We watched it? Shaman King? You did. I I did? You did. Dress up. 
Hey. Okay. Jensen I didn't watch that one. Yeah. Yeah, 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 they did a fairy Jensen. tale. Oh, they did one of the f- they did one of the fate series. So that's pretty impressive. Mm. It's like the worst one know. though. <laughs> Imagine. I don't know. I I watched two of them and I never watched any of them. And they did all the Persona <laughs> ones. Oh, nice. Persona's really good. Okay, cool. I'm excited, man. I I just like the I just like <gasps> the uh... and Wonder Egg priority. Jeez. Yeah, I like uh I like. I like the drawings are like that. Like she is. I don't know. Every the 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 story direction, the characters, the premise, the originality. It's it's all mm-hmm. there. It's all there. It's all okay. jam packed into a little little Anya. Um, and as the motherfucker leaves, uh, we are gonna talk about another show. And I don't know what show we're talking about now. What are we talking Shield about? Shield Hero. Shield Hero. Uh, fantastic. Hero. Yeah, I'll do. I'll do. So. It? Oh wait, wait. Andre already talked about it. So. Yeah. They're gonna go fight a turtle. Um. <laughs> I don't even give a fuck about calling it a tortoise anymore. I don't care. <laughs> right? Um, they're going to go fight still. a turtle that apparently can demolish souls uh, yeah. in an instant. Um, he has a familiar that looks like a woman. Mm-hmm. And she's very, very suicidal. So that's pretty much that episode. Yeah. Well, can I please bring up the fact that this lady really came into their like uh, their meeting and it was like, yeah, uh, I'm a familiar of the tortoise turtle thing. And so my job is to get countries to fight each other and kill each other and those souls go to like stopping the, the uh, portals or whatever. And I'm like, nobody's going to like react to this, to the fact that this girl's responsible for like <laughs> they're all, they're hundreds of like, thousands of deaths. Yeah, they're all like, ah, okay. Nice. Exactly. <laughs> like, I'm what? like, dude, this lady got so many people killed. Like she just admitted to it in front of all so of you. Stupid. And like everyone's just like, oh yeah, uh, nobody reacts to it at all. No, it doesn't even like respond to it. Um. Also, I'm not really sure what she meant by like. Why, why did she say kill me? Like, did she mean like by extension the tortoise or like? I think I think I, I don't know. Like, yeah, like physically kill her there because I I do. It. Yeah. Um. Or mm-hmm. like, yeah, like do you want like do you want us to like metaphorically kill you by killing the tortoise? Um, yeah, and yeah, her advice was know. just so uh, so helpful. <laughs> And everyone Cut off knew his head. It. You're good. It's like, like uh, Nafumi's like, yeah, that's like, that's usually how everyone dies. You just cut off their head. <laughs> and then she's like, oh, um, he's over there. And like, they're all like, yeah, yeah, we know. Like, we we yeah. tracked it like uh, like two days ago. It's like, oh, okay, uh, well, I'm useless. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, though, like by the time we got to the end, I was pretty hyped about them like fighting the tortoise. I was like, yeah. Like, I don't yeah. know why. Why? I just like, got to like some rush of excitement. Like, yeah, okay. What, it seems what, like a big deal. Yeah, I, what, it's I not can't, like a letdown. Yeah, what I can't wait for is the um, I, like I know I know you talked about it before. Wait, like a couple weeks ago, like um, it's like an RPG type um, mm-hmm. show. So I can't wait mm-hmm. to see what he gains into his shield from him. Yeah, um, that's the only thing I really watched this show for before. It's like oh, he like killed a slime, so now he has like a slime shield. Or mm-hmm. he killed like a tornado, like a, a wind person. Now he can you know whatever tornado, and then um, and now he has this weird like rage shield that like makes him go crazy. So. I, I can't wait to see uh, about like the the turtle uh, if he gets like a, yeah. the, he gets a shield shield you know like the, the, mm-hmm. the short you know the shell shield yeah right. and if he could somehow like harness its power to stop the um, the warp it, what, what's it called the to, uh, the waves the, the waves from coming like yeah. maybe he could absorb some of the turtle like into his shield and uh, use the power to uh, maybe he kills monsters and those souls instead are used towards like stopping the waves from coming. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. but I'm interested to see because there has to be some kind of permanent solution to that eventually. Yeah, um, yeah, like um, you're right, you're right. I and I think I think they're gonna get to that, but I just don't know when. So um, the one thing I'm afraid of, like, uh, is they're saying what there's like eleven of these like sacred swordsmen or whatever. Oh, you, seven. Yeah, you think they're just gonna? Well, I mean, thing. I, well, I was just thinking like, why? Like, that's so many characters. <laughs> I really hope that they don't like. Try to make me care about all of them because I'm I'm not gonna. I I think they're just gonna kill him off like the next episode. Yeah, they're gonna be like, oh, be, all, all, be all eleven, all eleven have died. He's so strong. <laughs> not for me. Please kill the tortoise. I'm down and with then, that. I'm down too. So I'm Andre, like, I, you yeah. missed it, but uh, I was mentioning how like I thought it was kind of bullshit that like this lady just came into their meeting and it was talking about how she's responsible for so many people, like getting killed Wait, and then what? The, you know the what? Oh, sorry, Shield Hero. We're talking about Shield Hero. Yeah, yeah, I know. But like she was saying, was like responsible for she like people? she like went yeah, um, were, into the ranks. Angry. Yeah, she went into the ranks of like these generals or whatever, and got like countries to like fight each other and kill each other to get these souls like put towards the waves or whatever. And like nobody's reacting to that. Like she's responsible for so many deaths. Like what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know. 
Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. It's... Oh, Andre don't like it. Andre don't uh-huh. like it. No, 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 no. I'm not saying that I don't like it. Um, again, I'm still giving it time to like build, and like Ferment. make like turn into something. Pretty much, like I'm right, letting right. it build because at the end of the day, like we were very like um kind of like intrigued on this random girl that showed up, and then she's just like, oh yeah. I, I'm like the familiar and then she's like but I can help you guys and then couldn't help me. Yeah, which made zero sense. <laughs> Just cut its head off. Yes, that'll do everything. <laughs> Not for me. Right. Yeah. We I mean I that. guess it's like, oh that's like the f- they should focus on that versus what they would have usually done, yeah. which is kind of like, Oh, this could have been an idea kind of thing, but tried other things. But um I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I'm still, I still have faith in it. It still seems like it's intriguing because like the purpose of the spirit turtle tortoise, Mm -hmm. sorry, sorry. It's very interesting. It's very interesting because like his whole goal, he's not technically bad, I guess. He's kind of like one of those like um, ancient like beings on the planet whose goal is to like save the earth, which also explains why I'm assuming the the clock stopped mm-hmm. it's because the friggin turtle was like offering up all the souls mm. but yeah. like who is he offering these souls to and why does that stop the clock the bigger tortoise oh, i got no idea <laughs> and see tortoise these guy. are the kind of questions which could make it interesting if we if they kind of dive deeper into these kind of yeah. themes right so yeah i don't know they, we'll they really haven't had a um i still i still feel like it's um it's um like a skill like development art because they still haven't found someone that really could kill Nafumi, and um, I think I think once they do like a, like an actual like adversary that really could fuck him up, I feel like then we'll be like, ah, yeah, this is good. For now, it's just fodder. It's like okay, now we gotta go get the the tortoise's yeah. shield so we can or shell or power so then we can put it into the shield and Nafumi will be a little bit stronger. R- Raphelia is kind of like just like doing the same shit she has been um, for the past ten years and yeah. So do you think this th- this fight seems to like be starting next episode? Like, do you think it'll be a quick uh, fight, or what direction is this going to go in? Yeah, I think I'm the, hoping. I, I'm I'm hoping. I think turtle. I think turtle gets like a super saiyan mode after he almost dies, and then they kill him. So I don't know if that's one episode or one and a half. I don't know if they're going to mm. make it. You know, whatever. We'll see. But see, that's the kind of thing where I was talking about last episode, where I was like, I kind of hope the turtle is like super quick. Like, no more than, I guess, out of 12, no more than four episodes, I'd say, mm-hmm. all the turtle, like, dealt with. Unless, obviously, it has a greater like significance relation to the, story. To the yeah. grand story. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which seems like that's what they're hinting at. Yeah, that's what it feels like. <clears throat> also, when the girl said, yo, kill me, kill me. Was she talking about her specifically? Or <laughs> we turtle? talked about this. No, no, I, that's good. That's good. So yeah, we were saying like we don't know because she was kind of like, "Kill me now," and then she was just like, "Oh no, you and can." And she you left. Can kill the tur- yeah, she disappeared. She's like, "Oh, you can kill the turtle." Like it's fine. Don't don't kill. And me then now. she said she can't die unless the turtle dies. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. So what the hell? It was definitely yeah. it was definitely like uh, metaphorical. Like you need to yeah, kill, for, yeah. you need to get rid of this turtle. I will go away, but you do need to get going, or else like a lot of people <laughs> are gonna die. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Mm. still it's still there. It still has got my attention. Um, yeah, but they they also continue to insist to make like every other character outside of his party a complete idiot, like with the generals and everything. That's true. Yeah. And I'm just like, why is every single one else so incompetent except for the, like the main guy? <laughs> Like, even the other heroes are still like, uh, oh, you're so useless. Like, why are you even here? For real. Yeah, for real. Sure. Like, the shield hero is the only one who actually does anything. And then, like, yeah, I got nothing more. No, that's pretty <laughs> that's much all I got. Yeah. We'll see. Yeah. With shield hero, I'm just like, I'm still in, like, a wheel seat. Oh, yeah. I, I'm actually excited for the fight I, for some reason. I don't know why, but, like, when I when I saw that it was actually going to happen next episode, and yeah, like, Sean, the, the, I was like, if, yeah, it's cool. What if like the turtle, like when he when he sees like Nafumi, just gets up on two legs and does some like crazy <laughs> like kung fu kick and just fucking wipes out? Oh my god, like, the whole city. We, like Isn't what can a, hold on? What can a fucking turtle do? Like he could, okay, I'm Walk. assuming. What if what if what happens is they create like a super weapon made specifically to chop the turtle head off, but then it doesn't work. So instead, they use the power and love and punch it in the face, and then it explodes. Like like Rafili goes like Rafili goes like, 
<laughs> and like it just fucking blows up. Yeah, maybe, <laughs> maybe. Dude, just dig a hole and then like lead it into the hole, and then you're good. That's what I was. That's what my first <laughs> just, thought like, was literally it. make. Just like it was yeah, literally exactly. to make a, a like a trench type thing, yeah. like a trap where like it steps on it and then falls into a big hole. <laughs> Turtles can't and then climb it can't walls. Get out. Yeah, yeah, but then like it gets up on two feet and does like a JoJo bizarre pose. <laughs> yo, and then and then what? What's over. with um? What's with the priest dude who he's like, yo, we can definitely blow up that fortress, but like. Also, everyone will die if we do that. Oh, man. Yeah, he's just like, yeah. Like, like, no, no, no one even talked to him. He's just like, yeah, why don't we just kill everyone if we, if we have the power? And then everyone's just like, like, what? Like, who is this guy? Who yeah, and Shidio's yeah. like, okay, how about I, uh, we use just these bombs instead? Like, <laughs> work. I was also thinking, like, they're like, okay, the turtle's going to come from here. There's a fortress over there. Can we blow up the fortress? And it's like, what's that have to do with the turtle? What? Yeah, yeah it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> He's like, yes, we can, but half of us will die. And he's like, okay. I'm just like, what's going on? I don't know. Uh, it never made sense to me. Funny episode, honestly. But yeah, it was good. Unintentionally. Unintentional, mate. But yeah, now we got executioner. Executioner girl. Um, I like I like this episode. Uh, a little bit more character development. We found we found the girl that she's been seeing a vision of, I believe, or dream. So this is her, I believe. The, the scene where the girl is crying and she's like, oh, uh-huh. you know, I met you for the first time and all that. I believe that she's getting Aaron Yeager at that moment and her mm. and her and her future self is seeing Executioner Girl die. And she's so sad because she she's dead in the future. But right now she's <laughs> seeing her. So she's alive and she's like, oh, I'm so glad I met you today. Because like, remember that scene? I don't know if it's in the intro of the show where she's like lying down. But then it shows her skeleton in the same position. Do you guys do you guys see that? Yeah, Rough yeah, I've seen that. In the intro, like when the music starts, no, no. it's like talking- oh <laughs> shit, <laughs> wrong, wrong anime. Yes, 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 yes. So, yeah, so it seems like, like she too. dies, and then because she has the power of time, she reverses it. Kind of not reverse, maybe not reverse. Because you see her face, you see her after the skeleton. Right, right, right. Face, it like, goes back and back. forth. Yeah, but I thought that. like uh, that, okay, perfect. So then that what I was thinking is like this girl, she's getting like the the Edenyaga memories sent to her, mm. where she's like, oh, she's dead, but be happy, like go, go I'm sending you memories, like. She's dead. Go be happy in that moment. So yeah, I don't know. Uh, that'd be kind or of. Or maybe time was just reversed to that point because that was her Ooh. power, right? So maybe her yeah, power. she got has that. She has the point. power of that bleach girl. What's that girl's name? That. Or he man. Yeah. Or he may. Yeah, she has that. Her her power. I, I I'm not healing you. I'm just reversing time around the wound. It's like oh, <laughs> that's healing, man. All right, thanks. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> so what do you think? What do you think is going to be the thing that makes her? keep her alive basically but i mean like her like right hand lady basically said she said no but she said like hey you've never spent this much time with like a other world Mm -hmm. i don't know if you're like ready to be doing this so like what do you think is gonna be like the trigger where she's like oh maybe we shouldn't be killing this girl and she can figure it out uh maybe just more exposure to her niceties i think I think it's a, it's a little Gojo. I'm bringing all the shows now. I think it's like okay. how Gojo, like Gojo knows the elders are shit because they can't, they don't like change. I think that's what's happening here. I think the elders, like the person she's talking to mm-hmm. is like one of the head council people. And she's like, the, these people that you get truck into our world have more powers than us in this world. We cannot let them live or else we lose power. So she, they, they make this girl kill all of them. So I think like she's, once, once she sees how, how good these uh, lost ones, I think that's what they refer to them as. Once yeah. once they see how good the lost ones are for their world, actually, the good ones anyway, um, th- then she'll be like, wait, why are we killing these people that could save or make our lives better and all that? I think that's what it might be. Mm. Yeah, that's interesting. Guys. But I'm not sure like if there's a precedent for that. Like, like, are there people with powers who are good for the world in that world? I'm not even sure. Like, are there any who are even still sure. alive? Or, or are these like uh, religious people just like hunting them all down and they're all mm. dead by now because clearly they have more authority than like the king and you know when the religion has like militaristic power it's not it doesn't usually end well it never ends well dude <laughs> no <Our laughs> isekai world and everyone ends well no but um <laughs> yeah i'm not really sure how like i hope it's not just like um typical oh this girl's actually really nice i don't want to kill her anymore like i hope it's more than that maybe more the intricate, main yeah. girl like see something or like she just gets smarter in terms of like what are we actually doing? Yeah. Um, and there's like some under, like underlying plot or yeah. uh, scheme to do with it. Yeah. What do you guys think? I think I think that's it. What about you, Andre? 
Andre's like, oh. I kind of think it's going to be... <laughs> oh, you're really nice and I like you, so I don't want uh, to. I really hope not, though. Come on, man. I really think it's no. Gonna... I just don't I think, feel, I, honestly, uh... I just don't think she can die. And I don't know about the whole, <laughs> hey, I, I'm going to kill you now. I think she's like... She's in. She's not. She's not able to die. So they're gonna spend a lot of time together. Yeah. And probably. then, and then the main characters gonna be like, "Yo, like, why are we killing these people? They're good." She like, she saved me. You know, fuck, man. I mean, I was thinking what Andre was saying, but like, seeing her just mercilessly just like stab her in the back of the head was both hilarious and yeah. also like, oh, is that it's okay? That this is what <laughs> we're watching. Yeah. Okay. Like, like I hope it stays on that kind of like darkish um, route. <laughs> Yeah. And like, on, like I did not expect that, especially with the first guy. Like, it was just complete, <laughs> like, like complete surprise to me. Yeah. Uh, or at least I thought he would like somehow come back, like she did, but not, not for him apparently. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I don't know if you guys said this before, but like I was telling Alan before the pod that I was really excited that it wasn't kind of like, oh, this girl's in my mm-hmm. dreams. I can't kill her. She did it. She's yeah. just like, nah, that's my job. And stab her in the neck. <laughs> she, like, she did it. No remorse, no. no question. And the only reason this continues is because of her OPS power. Yeah. And, like, I'm, I'm okay with that so far. We'll yeah. see where it goes, but so far, that is a reason that has me accepting it so far and mm-hmm. and, and wanting to continue the anime. Yeah. yeah. I wonder how they get around it, or how like like what you guys are saying. What what um what changes her mind from killing her? Um, cause she's still, she's definitely still wanting, needing to and wanting to, cause yeah. that's her job and she knows that, For sure. um, which is cool. I like that. It's not like first episode. Oh, you looked at me. I can't kill you anymore. So yeah, that's, no, that's good. That's good. What else we got? What else we got? Love is it, war, man. <laughs> oh shit. That's it. Well, okay. Honorable mentions. That's I watched it, Ayo oh. Ashi, which is the soccer anime that came out one episode. Yeah, Loki it? Fire. Um, uh, main really? character is a fucking genius. Like. No, no crazy powers. It's no like kung fu hustle or Shaolin soccer shit. Like mm-hmm. it's legit. Like the the his coach, which doesn't play soccer anymore, of course. The trope of you know many many coaches of of life um, is like, oh, can you explain to me? Like he's like, oh, you you don't even know the game. Like how do you? And the kid goes, no, I remember at this minute this guy did this and this guy was over here. That blah blah blah. Like he took the cross, but our center defensive didn't really move up. And then after like oh, the whole spiel, the coach leaves like. Holy shit, he remembered everyone's position at every minute, at every time, at every second. This kid's a genius. So, um, I think we only get I only we only got introduced to one character, which is the main guy and the coach. And what they do is I think they're gonna find like a bunch of misfits that like don't like to play or like mm. are really good at like sports or something like that and have good characteristics and then they're just gonna make a team. And um our main character by 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 far is not a good player but he is very <laughs> smart and that, that's usually who becomes the captain is someone that's like super super just you know very supportive he does have like the uh, together everyone vibe but um but that's just what it that's just what it is honestly mm-hmm. if you like soccer if you like sports animes in general pretty good watch um uh, it's only first episode though so i don't know okay all right good. i'm gonna have to give it my i'm gonna have to give it yeah. a watch man yeah you know do it do it because like it, it's, it's gonna give us some uh some stretch stretching uh for uh blue lock which is coming out mm-hmm. ever since i watched kuroko's basketball i've been oh. praying for like a soccer oh, yeah man, she, i was like i was like desperate to the point where i was like oh i'm gonna watch a zuma 11 yeah. and i'm like oh this is just shaman king but with soccer balls. yeah literally soccer balls and shit no this one the the, the they, they do a lot of uh movement the ball moves man i don't they haven't played a game yet but like they like the so the coach kicked the ball at him and like mm. the the ball animation was kind of fire, so I was like, "Ooh, I might actually watch this." Did a CG ball? No, no, no. They they two D'd that shit. They two D'd. Really? That. Yeah, but it was only Damn. one kick, and it was just the first, like maybe after the first still, ten though, minutes. Still, that's impressive because yeah. it's very easy to three D a ball. I thought yeah. they were just gonna do. That. I might I might actually not read. I might just go to the manga and just flip through it and see if they actually play a game or something. I don't want it to be like a the. I'm sure they're gonna play a game eventually. Yeah. Well, the, yeah, the yeah, thumbnail is the thumbnail is literally them in jerseys. Okay, and he's almost doing this Asageo fucking the crest thing, which is kind of crazy. Apparently, it was the same people who made that baseball anime that a lot of people like. Fire. Perfect. Another honorable mention, I don't think Andre watched it, but Sean, you did, was the uh, My Girlfriend Tommy. Isn't Just Cute oh. um, anime. It's really funny. I hate the main character because he's that he's that friggin' oh I'm useless and I I you know yeah. you know I'm useless and For oh, sure. yeah. But um the girl the girl's pretty funny. She's like she's the yeah. lead trying to like convince everyone she's actually useful and not just cute is basically what it is 
Yeah. Um, again, not saying that I think so, but that's just the premise of the show. Um, but yeah, uh, summertime render. I know Andre's been waiting for that one. I can't wait for mm-hmm. that one too. That one's we'll talk about that next week. Comey, Comey. is Comey. Comey is very very wholesome. So it, you know, you're eating some. You're in a late night. You just want to unwind and, and, and watch something. Comey, yeah, the Comey's big guy. Like, how funny was the big guy? The big guy was hilarious, <laughs> man. And I and I can't wait. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think we should uh, talk about it. I think we just okay. you watch it. You enjoy. Okay, that's pretty much it. Just saying, just saying the yeah. big. Also, Love Is War. I watched the first. Oh episode yes, of the sorry, season. I forgot about that one too. Oh man, one of the best things I've ever seen. It just had me laughing right off the bat. But, it's just but so like, funny. why? Why have? I mean, obviously, we watched the whole season and it worked. But why have two like Sundere characters like? The ones that don't like to show affection, but when they do, it's like a lot. But why both characters have to be like this? I hate it. It's <laughs> that's like, what apparently that's what the, that's the whole what thing makes that's it fun. No, I know. I watched yeah. the whole season. I watched the whole first season. Oh, you like, did. Okay. I, I hate that. Like my my idea of like a romance one is like um I don't I don't know which one was great that we watched. Uh, oh, so basically your idea is someone really wants someone and the other person doesn't mm-hmm. want them. No, no, and not so does the it. other person forces themselves no, on the other no, person. No, it's not. <laughs> no, I mean like, um, I, funny enough, dress up darling actually is is pretty decent with it. Like they both mm-hmm. know that they like each other. The girl shows it. The guy shows it to his best, but he's just very um, he's very reserved. So he doesn't he doesn't like. Yeah. He's very, he's an introvert. He's not like annoying about it but he like you know he knows what he does but you sh- oh, sean will watch it I, wa- let you know. I watched the first episode so oh god the second one's not good dude don't i mean you should just really? skip the second one and go to the third i'm I, i'm just saying um okay but more than uh kona super season two i don't know i haven't watched that shit i just saw cabbages <laughs> and i'm like yeah i don't want to watch this i'm scared <laughs> i was so scared man oh, um, man. but yeah that's pretty much it um okay all the shows yeah. that we watched will be talked about. If they're asked, they won't be talked about uh, for much Spoilers longer. for everything we talked about. Fuck it, dude. Oh, yeah. I mean, <laughs> At the end. First, 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 first week, second week, you, you got it. You got it. You know, this is going to be a spoiler thing. You know by now, bro. This yeah. is episode 58. And the, and the title of this thing is going to be like, we talked about six animes, question mark, exclamation mark. That's what it is. And uh, we hope you enjoyed. It's of course, right. we are going to wrap it up with, we do have some socials, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, um, the Facebook marketplace uh, and then also Insta Talk and WhatsApp. Please find us on there, Weeb Gamer or Weeb Gamer Podcast. Link is in the link tree in the in description if you're watching us on YouTube. Tumblr. Um, Tumblr. Oh, uh, yeah, I, you know, whatever. Uh, I used to code, yeah, holy shit. Um, Fridays is when you can see us, uh, or sorry, hear us on uh, on our podcast uh, thing sites uh, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Podcast, 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 Spotify. Um, fantastic. Usually up around the 7 a.m., 8 a.m. mark, so you guys can take your morning dumps while hearing shit at the same time. Uh, on YouTube, uh, usually I, we do it around 9 a.m., you know, just get you your morning coffee ready, or if you're going to bed at that time because it's Saturday, <laughs> just go ahead and watch us. My face will keep you up, though, so don't pay attention to me. <laughs> um, that being said, we uh, I am Alan. I'm Andre. Yeah, I'm Sean. I don't know why I'm doing this because I'm always to the right. Um, For and, me, it's on the other side. <laughs> so yeah, going and the wrong way. And this and this spring season, keep up to date to see who's the sussy baka from Tomagachi Gaming. Bye. Bye. <laughs>